Hi, it's me again with Corolla Gold Tips and Tricks. I have two identical horses, and they have really sharp points of interest in their drawing. So if we if we fill them in with black, this is what they look like. Really cool. The person wants to cut them out with a vinyl cutter, and they don't want all the little bitty jagged pieces for the vinyl. They want them more smoother. So what they're they want a 0.05 contour cut line so we're going to go to effects and contour we're going to contour to the outside 0 0.05 and this is what you get you get all these in and out in and out and little bitty holes and they say that that's I don't really understand when they peel off the vinyl but uh, they want something a little thicker what you could do is take this horse and contour the outside with rounded corners like before, but contour 0.5. Then go up to object and break the contour apart. Go up to object. We'll probably have to select everything. Go up to object and I should be able to break the curve apart. Maybe I'll just click on the red. Go to up to object and break the curve apart and then get rid of this interior piece. Now this contour line is a separate line totally. Now we're going to contour the inside 0.45 which is going to give us a 0.05 contour. And then we go to object, break contour apart, get rid of that contour. So now we have just sloping edges of the vinyl, I'm guessing. And you don't have that interior part. Now, if you wanted that interior part, you could still have it uh, very easily. And I'll just, let's just, uh, well, let's do, let's just back up here. Remember when we had that interior part? Let's do this. We have, it's still by itself. Let's set our nudge, let's see how big this is. It's over, uh, so let's make it 14 inches. Let's take that part and nudge it over. Now we're gonna take that contour and go to the inside 0.45, okay? Then we're gonna take this part and go, we can't go to the inside, we're gonna go to the outside 0.45. Then we can break that contour apart. Well, matter of fact, select everything, go up to object, break the three objects apart, and take this interior contour and nudge it over. Now you have a, you might, might want to join these together. Uh, that would be uh, probably the best thing to do. And, and, and one of the reasons, let's take away the outside contour. So it kind of looks better. Whoop, I didn't break it apart. So that's what it's going to look like. Now, if you wanted to join those together, you could add nodes and bring that, you know, kind of manually do it. Uh, maybe bring this node over here, add a node. And this is just a suggestion. I don't know anything about vinyl cutting. Let's try to delete that node and add a node like right there. And then we could use our handles. And then we could very easily take the virtual segment delete key and cut through here. Then to make that shape safely, I would think maybe suggesting let's get rid of this piece. And I did it again, I don't really have totally understand vinyl cutting. Let's get the smart fill tool and fill in that contour, move that out of the way, left click, right click, and break the contour apart. Take the virtual segment delete key and delete that one. And now let's see what it looks like. Whoop, have to take that other one away. And see, these are two different lines. And now we can nudge this over. And that also made that one contour to cut line. 
So now you have a sweeping, you know, um, contour. And you could probably do the same thing, you know, manually up here, but that'd be a lot of work. You know, if you look at that, let's fill in the horse now. And that's what you would get. The red is going to be your cut line. And you could go up in here more. You know, uh, it worked perfectly here. And, and, and I'm guessing that'll work there. I don't really know. But maybe that'll at least get them started. Anyway, hope that helped them a little bit. Thank you for watching.